Hi everyone, my name is Olivia. I am a second year political science public service major at UC Davis. I'm also pursuing a minor in community and regional development. Um, you're probably wondering, where are you right now? Um, I'm filming this from the inside of my home in San Diego, California. If you're watching this, you probably know what's going on in the world um, due to the unfortunate COVID-19 pandemic. Um, I've been sent home. I've been here for quite a while now, and as much as I miss everybody, all my professors and friends and the squirrels on campus, um, I will be here till, until it is safe to go back to Davis. So um, the university just really wants to make sure that we're all being safe, and that's the number one priority. Um, but I can't wait to see everybody back again um, this summer or at least next fall. Um, and I kind of want to share with you my UC Davis experience. So. Um, I'm a first generation student, which means I'm the first person in my family that's been able to attend college. Uh, my parents are super proud of me, and while they're super proud, they unfortunately told me they wouldn't be able to help me with any of my tuition. So um, because of that, um, I filled out the FAFSA with them anyways, and um, due to how much they make, I'm eligible for the Aggie Blue and Gold Plan, which basically allows the university to pay for all of my tuition and fees. Um, this is really great. This applies to everyone who makes under a certain amount um, of their annual income, and um, pretty much the whole UC system does it, and it's a really big reason of why I'm able to attend college. Um, other than all the scholarships and grants that get um, distributed every year, um, the Aggie Blue and Gold Plan is really awesome. It's money that I don't quite have to pay back and I have a minimal amount of loans that I get to take out. So definitely recommend filling out the FAFSA if it confuses you. Um, you can always call Dutton Hall, which is the UC Davis uh, Center for Financial Aid um, services. Um, I called them when I was an admitted student and I had no idea what I was doing and they really helped me out a lot with all the questions I had and it's just one of the many resources that we have here on campus that help out students who um, might need a little extra help. So um, UC Davis really looks out for our students who maybe are in vul vulnerable communities or marginalized communities or first generation students or things like that. So um, just one of the many things that I appreciate about our school. As far as you know, university life is, I actually lived in the residence halls my last year, or the dorms, um, more colloquially known. Um, and because I lived in the residence halls, I actually got a meal plan. Um, if you live in the residence halls, you're gonna get a meal plan. It kind of differs based on how much you wanna eat. Um, they have a five day plan and a seven day plan, but regardless, you get unlimited dining for whatever your allotted days are. So let's say I have the Monday through Friday plan, I could go in and out of the dining commons on a Wednesday, 30, 40, a thousand times if I wanted to. Um, and they have tons of really awesome food. They actually just opened up a brand new dining commons called Latitude, um, which actually just opened this past academic year, which has food from all over the world. Um, and I know tons of my friends wanted to check it out, so I went with them. Really awesome food. Um, so UC Davis definitely makes sure that, makes sure that all of our students are getting fed. Um, we also have Aggie Cash with every meal plan, so it's basically like a gift card that allows you to grab coffee on campus or um, eat at the food trucks or check out Pete's Coffee or, um, you know, any place that we have for food on campus that's not the dining commons, the DC markets, which are by the um, residence halls. Um, they have all your favorite junk food, um, Ben and Jerry's ice cream, Lay's chips, sandwiches, um, all that really fun stuff, smoothies, boba. Um, one of my favorite places to eat when I was a freshman, I ate way too much ice cream and it's also open late. So whenever you're studying and you need that extra snack, um, the university has that available. So really great food here at UC Davis. We make sure that nobody goes hungry. Um, we also have the pantry, which is really cool. It's run by ASUCD, which is Associative Students of UC Davis, our student government here on campus. Um, and basically <laughs> my dog, <laughs> sorry. Um, so basically the, um, the pantry allows students all over the university no matter who you are to grab five food items a day, um, no matter who you are. And um, it's really great. We make sure that nobody goes hungry. They have canned goods, beans. I got a Gatorade from there once. Um, so we really try to take care of all of our students and um, it's just a really great place to be. And I found my community and um, it's a beautiful campus and I hope that you get to see it one day. Congratulations on making it into UC Davis. Um, it's a really big accomplishment and I'm really happy for you. Congrats, newly admitted student. Um, you know, you got into one of the best public universities in the United States. So um, I hope to see you again next fall. And I hope you enjoyed hearing about my UC Davis experience.